Welcome back, and today we'll be looking at a new 3D print sheet by OSEQ. And I just recently completely ruined my Prusa satin print sheet by accident by toggling the wrong print sheet setting. I'm sure that happens to the most of us, or just me in particular. So I'm totally excited to test out this new OSEQ safe print sheet on my Prusa 3D printer. For fair honesty, I was given this free print sheet by OSEQ in exchange for my fair honest review. Now, I've been putting this test off for quite some time, mostly because Prusa satin sheet was the best of both worlds when it comes to printing both PETG and PLA. So the biggest question, especially for all those Prusa loyalists, is there room for a third party print sheet? Now after looking at this new safe print sheet, I have to say yes. OSEQ utilizes an ultra adhesive Ultim PE powder surface, which they describe as a velvet texture. And it's very smooth, flexible, double sided, and compatible with the usual typical range of 3D filaments. OSEQ also makes their print sheet compatible for the Prusa Mini and many other print bed size. So in my opinion, the two biggest market differentiation for this print sheet is one, it incorporates a unique safe element in this print sheet which hasn't been seen before, which turns red when the sheet warms up to 40 degrees Celsius or more. Is this going to make your print better? No, not absolutely, but at least it will keep your hands safe and it also adds another layer of comfort letting you know that your printer heat bed is functional. And the second element, which was completely accidental while filming, was that grease spots were completely visible, which made it clear when it was necessary to give your sheet a proper cleaning. As always with any new print sheet, do your first layer calibration. After the first layer of calibrations, I like to hone in the z-axis height even further with printing a 75mm square. It's a little bit hard to see in the video, but the upper diagonal half of the square looks perfectly fine. So let's go ahead and print some actual prints. So my first test, I use Overture Pet G which is printing an actual customer order. This is the Atmos Mini Caddy which I sell on my Etsy page. For the first print test, it looked absolutely beautiful. There's no print adhesion loss throughout the entire surface. And if you look at the underside, it's nice, even, and this is what I expect for my products. Now for my second test, I'll be using PLA Plus from Monoprice to print out a rosette. This is another product I sell on my Etsy page, which is infinitely difficult to print out because it requires good bed adhesion. For the most part, this print requires a lot of support to only get all the points on the rosette to print out perfectly. And oftentimes on the Prusa satin sheet, I'll forget one or two failures due to the bed adhesion failure. For the most part, these rosette printed it out as perfect as they can on a 3D printer. In my opinion, OSEQ print sheet performs as well as Prusa satin sheet because it's pretty much hard to distinguish the two performance wise. And to this day, I'm still using my OSEQ print sheet for my customer order and I will highly recommend it for those who are looking to add another layer of safety. So that's all I have for today. Hit the like and subscribe button. If you have any thoughts or comments, put it in the section below. Until next time, happy printing.